Here's we've got a Bauer gearbox trolley assembly from GM Lordstown plant, and this is how I test it with a drive assembly that we've got from GM themselves, modified to work on our power system. We're going to test the motor in the low speed, the high speed, putting 200 volts AC into the motor, which is what they require at GM. We're looking for an optimum output of 100 RPMs in the high speed, 15 RPMs in the low speed. Also, the trolley has to work in a neutral position. When you shift it to neutral, it must turn manually for whatever purposes they need to remove it from line. So what we're going to do is going to go ahead and power it up, and then we'll go to the high speed, the low speed, and then the neutral checks. And that's pretty much how we test them on the way out. We're going to go hot. We're hot. I'm going to try the high speed. We'll put a tack on around. We're going to try and get the speed from the tack at 100 RPMs, which is optimal. We'll let her shut down, and we'll go to the low speed side. The low speed side it takes a little longer to get a reading, but what we're looking for is the optimum of 15 RPMs. And as you can see, that's what the customer requires. That's what we get. Now, this, the third test is the neutral manual turn test, where you shift the box into neutral and manually be able to turn the wheels so that they can move the trolley on and off the track as needed. And pretty much that's it.